Each year, the U.S. spends more than $100 billion on prisons and jails. For decades now, prisoner incarceration has been about systemic oppression, not correctional rehabilitation. What if rehabilitation and not oppression was the goal? A prisoner's path will showcase a new side of prison reform. Instead of locking our convicted offenders up, a prisoner's path showcases the power of empowering inmates to find the tools to help themselves. For the record, sir, what's your name? My name is Jeffrey Dwayne Richardson. How many times have you been incarcerated before? About five times. And how old are you? I'm 30 years old, sir. 30 years old? You have to keep calling me sir. You have called me sir in a year I've been in here with you. <laughs> I'm not the person or the monster. I just think of me. <laughs> The tattoo on your neck says what, right there in the front? It say, live by the gun, die by the gun. King County is located about 35 miles straight west of Chicago. And the county itself is a really good model for any other county in America. It's got rural, it's got urban, it's got low income, it's got extremely wealthy people. Based on the popular podcast, A Sheriff and His Inmates, with Sheriff Ron Hayne, each episode will introduce the audience to a prisoner currently incarcerated and on their way out. We learn their story, we learn the stories of their crimes, and we witness their efforts to truly be rehabilitated before entering back into society. I had problems, I made mistakes, but when I do my art, it defines me. They have one systemic thing in common. Well, I am a drug addict. I'm tired of living the way I live. I was more a, a, a product of my environment. I've got so much blood in my hands that it's not funny. We saw a very high recidivism rate here in Kane County's highest 60%. What I noticed was that the high crime areas were also the low income areas. Hoping to show the judge they have changed for the better, we follow each prisoner's journey through prison, back to civilian life, and a new path. Do people deserve a second chance? What does it mean to be free? A prisoner's path. Everyone has the right to a second chance.